Reading Course Development for English 115 Students Chapter 7 Experimental Science Unit 3 They found their Nobel inside their stomach Objectives After completing this unit, students will be able to Describe the Nobel Prize winners in 2005 Explain the process of causing ulcers by certain bacteria and understand the growth of certain bacteria in the stomach. Paragraph 1 Two Australian researchers discovered that a bacterium, not stress, or spicy food causes stomach ulcers. They were given the 2005 Nobel Prize in Medicine, a $1.3 million award for this important discovery. Paragraph 2 Dr. J. Robin Warren, 68, and Dr. Barry J. Marshall, 54, changed opinions that doctors held for decades. They found a bacterium called Helicobacter pylori and demonstrated that it could produce stomach ulcers, serious wounds in the stomach. The researchers produced one of the most radical and important changes in the last 50 years in the perception of a medical condition, said Lord Robert May, President of the Royal Society. Paragraph 3. The slow acceptance of their idea began when Marshall swallowed a bottle of Helicobacter pylori. He wanted to show that the bacterium caused stomach illness. It did. He got very sick. Researchers now know that Helicobacter pylori causes more than 90% of lower stomach ulcers and 80% of upper intestinal ulcers, the Nobel Committee said. Paragraph 4. In the years before their research was accepted, many fellow scientists did not believe them. Drug companies that made money selling medicine for controlling the symptoms of ulcers didn't believe them either. Finally, doctors began to widely accept the discovery when they observed the results in their patients. Ulcers could be cured quickly with a short course of antibiotics. I was treating my patients with the then traditional methods for ulcers when his work first published. I truly did not believe it until I saw what it did for my patients said Dr. David Pura of the University of Virginia. Paragraph 5 The research got its start in 1979. Dr. Warren, a pathologist, observed what he thought was a bacterium in the lower part of the stomach in more than half of his patients. He also saw areas of swelling around the bacteria. He was surprised by the discovery because doctors had argued for decades that the inside of the stomach was too sour for any bacteria to grow. Researchers now know that the bacterium infects about half the population around the world. Only a small number of those infected develop ulcers. The discovery that ulcers were caused by bacterium led to research on other diseases that might have infectious origins, the Nobel Committee said. Match the following words with its correct meaning on the right. Number one, spicy. Muhammad, please give us the correct meaning on the right. C. Food that might give a burning feeling in your mouth. Now, let's take a look at a picture related to the vocabulary word spicy. Muhammad, could you please talk about this? Well, I see a pepper in this picture. And pepper gives you a burning feeling in your mouth. And that is spicy. Now, let's take a look at a paragraph which contains the vocabulary word spicy. I'll read the sentence for you. Two Australian researchers discovered that a bacterium, not stress or spicy food, causes stomach ulcers. Number two, bacterium. Mohammed, please give us the correct meaning on the right. D. Very small living things that can cause disease. Now, let's take a look at a picture related to bacterium. Mohammed, can you talk about this? I see here very small living things and they've been studied because they're causing some diseases and that is bacterium. Now let's take a look at a paragraph containing the vocabulary word bacterium. I'll highlight the sentence for you. They found a bacterium called Helicobacter pylori and demonstrated that it could produce stomach ulcers, serious wounds in the stomach. Number three, antibiotics. Mohammed, please give us the correct meaning on the right. B, drugs that are used to kill bacteria and cure infections. Now let's take a look at a picture related to the vocabulary word antibiotics. Mohammed, could you please talk about this? 
I see in this picture this person trying to take these pills, these drugs, because they are antibiotic, and he's trying to kill the bacteria inside him and cure the infections. Now let's take a look at a paragraph containing the vocabulary word antibiotics. Ulcers could be cured quickly with a short course of antibiotics. Number four, patients. Muhammad, please give us the correct meaning on the right. E. People being taken care of by doctors. Now let's take a look at a picture related to the vocabulary word patients. Muhammad, could you please talk about this? I see someone who's being ill and there's a doctor beside him taking care of him. And that's what patient means, being taken care of by doctor. Now, let's take a look at a paragraph containing the vocabulary word, patients. Finally, doctors began to widely accept the discovery when they observed the results in their patients. Number five, pathologist. Muhammad, please give us the correct meaning on the right. A. Someone who studies the cause and effect of illness. Now, let's take a look at a picture related to pathologists. Muhammad, could you please talk about this? This guy, he is a pathologist because he's studying the cause and the cure of illness. Now, let's take a look at a paragraph containing the vocabulary word pathologist. I'll read part of the sentence for you. The research got its start in 1979. Dr. Warren, a pathologist, observed what he thought was a bacterium. Choose the best answer. Question number one. Two Australian researchers discovered that the cause of a stomach ulcer is... B. A bacterium. Let's take a look at the paragraph which gives us this answer. I'll highlight the sentence for you. They found a bacterium called Helicobacter pylori and demonstrated that it could produce stomach ulcers, serious wounds in the stomach. Question number two. Because of their important discovery, they won... B. The Nobel Prize in Medicine. Now, let's take a look at a paragraph which gives us this answer. Paragraph one in the bottom. They were given the 2005 Nobel Prize in Medicine a $1.3 million award for this important discovery. Now, let's have a discussion. Mohammed, can you please tell us some of the things that you've learned? I learned that bacterium causes stomach ulcers and stress. This was discovered in 2005 by two Australian researchers that received the Nobel Prize in Medicine.